Well, hello there, people. <clears throat> nice having you. Hope everyone is doing uh, mighty well. And uh, let's get into this. Um. Wait, what? Oh, it's because it is the... I'm sorry. It is because it is the... Uh, the dev server, right? Yeah, there we go. Um, Now we just gotta... Oh, whoop, there I am. Hello, everyone. Um, Hey, Murphy, Yamato. Yeah, nice. Hey, Tomato, Exodus. Uh, Yes. Uh, no, that was real stuff. Um, th that was uh, after me, uh, after I left that regiment. But that was uh, from my old regiment, the Seventh Army Regiment. Uh, my day has been very long. I've been working today. I had a twelve-hour shift, um, so I'm kind of tired. Um, but I had a very nice eight and a half hours of sleep last night, so I feel very fresh. Um, I usually sleep around four hours per night or something like that, which is not very healthy. Don't do that. Um, so I feel mighty fine today um so yeah i have not received my uh, cc pack yet uh, with all the uh um additional stuff um so uh it's gonna be a while until we can test everything but um gonna make it easy um i'm starting um press uh press present the presentation sorry i've been speaking swedish all day so it's always hard for me to speak english i will start the uh um presentation by showing off um sweden not because it is my own country but i, I simply like to start from um 
one side and the us usually have a lot of stuff to cover so it's easier for me to just start in a small nation and happen to be sweden so yeah there you go right uh, to left yes exactly that's exactly what we're doing and i know i asked about this um on my server but i will include the chat um when i do the uh, when i do the dev server for the simple reason of i intend to upload this to my youtube page for people who want to want to watch this so there we go um so yeah it's going to be a little bit um difficult uh, but we're gonna hey gomez how you doing place to go on my bucket list i think uh, like every nation they have some uh, unique stuff to offer um yeah i'm gonna use my own golden eagles for this uh these are golden eagles that i don't lose it's just a dev server so no need to be alarmed by that um okay we're gonna start by looking at the modifications what do we got what do we got what do we got it still had its NV nvds it's supposed to have thermals i have checked and double checked i've even found a, a promotional video for the ikv 105 and uh it is become very very clear that uh it is supposed to have thermals not very good they're kind of uh, generation one um i would actually say that looking at the picture i'm not entirely sure but i think they're pre they, they look kind of pre or like early generation one i should probably say um so hopefully we can get to that uh, which also renders that that this thing in combination with its potential reload and the ammunition it can fire it should not be a3 at all we're talking 9.0 at least people uh, i don't think i can use um all my uh, golden eagle or like i don't have the enough to uh um really sh buy everything so until i get the uh, uh the, the, the uh, other stuff then yeah okay so we have crewed it we're, we're gonna now ace it how much to i actually really want to do this because this is a vehicle that i um, i have a soft spot for i'm gonna be honest about that um one of the reasons why i have a soft spot for for this specific vehicle is because i uh my father served alongside these not on them um which i thought i would i actually said that in, in a previous uh, uh previous stream but uh, I asked him and he did not. Um, so let's just get that out of the way. But I do have a little bit of connection to it. Wow, this is so good looking. I like that. I actually, I'm one of the few who do really dislike this. I don't think it looks good at all. But uh, it should have the tricolor. I'm not going to buy it now. But it is what it is. Uh, so we have aced it. We're fully aced it. Reload coming down to four seconds flat. Four seconds when firing APFSDS in a light tank configuration. I think this is going to be exactly my kind of thing. Uh, I want you to remember that I am uh, someone who really enjoys um, light tanks. Light tanks is kind of like my thing. Oh, shit. The text. I'm an idiot. Can actually improve the chat box a little bit. Swedish bias confirmed. Oh, shit. Oh, we can do it like that. That's good. Okie dokie. Oh, what is my graphical settings? Looks weird. Uh, quality, yeah. Uh, I don't like that. Everything should be as high as it can go. But where, where is the grass then? Hello? Why is there no grass over there? I don't know. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna like this thing. Oh, uh, ooh, the new effects look really cool. Hey, freaky player, how you doing? Hey, Yag Buffet, how you doing? Freaky player, Lady Link, sorry. I don't know, I don't think. Hey, uh, Bubbo. Uh, TWM, how you doing? I'm back. Welcome back, Jen. There we go. 
yeah i'm gonna like this thing um this is exactly my kind of uh exactly my kind of thing no armor um i i kind of like that these vehicles do not have uh like super mobility uh, i think that is uh um in real life it was probably not uh, as good of a thing uh, they probably would have up engined it uh but i think that as for as far as game balance go i think that is exactly uh the balancing factor that you should go for okay grass turn off in gunner side yeah i do have it off in the getter gunner side i'm sorry i i just meant that i don't think it usually looks like this from afar in third person view uh yeah i mean look at the uh if you look at the values here of this thing uh for an 8.3 vehicle i mean the s v 104 and the uh 103 c or the s tank with the uh the c model has this apf sds the model 80. um what is what is kind of nice about this shell is that i actually have um a book at home from an armored officer with list which lists the uh uh the uh penetration capability of a lot of ammunition that sweden uh, um, uses and this one is also included in that and uh, the penetration values are actually exactly spot on well done gaijin it's always a nice fresh thing um although one thing that they do get wrong yet again which is something that is uh, happening more and more often is um that the uh, uh the weight of the projectile is off hey dave how you doing yeah i uh, hate to to fight a four-man squad of these yeah I, I completely agree um like I, I'm gonna explain uh, as far as I can. Remember that I have only studied this um, from the internet. I don't have any experience of this vehicle myself. So uh, when I speak about other vehicles like the SW 122 and the SW 90 c and stuff, I have been trained on the vehicle, not as a crew member, but as someone who is supposed to be able to uh, work with them and what the safety steps are and what you need to do. And also as a, as a medic uh, in the armored forces, uh, not the armed forces the armored forces and since i was in seventh army regiment um, you're supposed to be able to uh, uh know how to extract how to open hatches and do stuff so you you've, i've been trained a little bit on the vehicles i know uh, some stuff of them and you learn the data of them and, and stuff like that in classes um, so i do have a little bit of experience and then uh, what, I, what i've read from their instruction manuals with, which i have access to and stuff like that uh, what is the thing about this uh, thing what, why it is so incredibly fast on the reload is because as you can see you have a ready rack right next to the gun it is right next to the gun um it's not kept in any way kind of safety um like uh behind some blowout panels or in um wet uh what is, what is called these wet uh kind of tubes i can't remember what they're called yeah um so you're not kept in anything like that you're just kept completely in the open meaning that uh uh, the guy can literally lap load these so you could actually get the reload down on both on, on both the ikv 90 and the ikv 105 uh down to just a couple of seconds and i'm not even talking three seconds you could literally sit there and uh just open the hatch with one hand and then immediately just just push that shell in there the problem is that um at least with the ikv 90 that you were loading heat shells which means that you can't really be too fast um when loading the shell because you can damage it right you can you can hit it on the breech uh, or on the uh the uh first part of the barrel and you can actually damage the projectile which you don't want and that is kind of the limitation um it's less of a problem with apf sds um because of how it's mounted and everything but uh yeah army still use this vehicle no the uh, uh swedish military never invested in this vehicle or they invested in the uh develop like development and then the suggestion because um uh, the company that produced this is partially owned by the, the by the army so yeah with the early drop of two and eight it's nice but here one thousand two thousand three thousand four thousand where the hell did the shulka go oh it's supposed to be up here i'm missing a shulka oh there we go Oh. 
Uh, doesn't do that much damage to shell. The, the sprawling is not existent. Lower plate, lower plate, lower plate. Okay. Okay. My bad. I like the new uh, animation for when uh, tanks get hit. Looks mighty, mighty, mighty good. See that? That's a heavy tank. APF is DS, baby. You just punch straight through. No problem. Driver. I still got the driver there. I was just, uh, yep. You see, this thing just punches straight through. Um, well, that's the IKV-91. And, and do, I want you to remember now, people, this thing is not fully spaded right now. I have not received the, uh, uh, my, uh, uh, in-game currency and, uh, all the, all the new vehicles from Gaijin yet. Uh, so I'm, 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 I'm one of the CCs who are still waiting for, for them to be added to my account. So in the meanwhile, we're going to have to, uh, um, look around with, uh, what we got. You got your goodies. I'm glad, man. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. A million golden eagles. It feels so surreal every single time. Oh man. This puts a smile on my face. Yeah. This puts a smile on my face. Yeah. Another million. <laughs> Six million. <laughs> your words are not collected, dude. Oh, wait, did he update this too? No. Okay, it's the old battle pass season. Yeah, yeah. Relogging. Ah, got it. So now it's fully spaded, eh? No? Oh, I'll, I'll spade it. Okay, then. <laughs> I'll spade it. Um, or... Oh, shit. My bad. Let's see if there's... Let's quickly go back into the test drive in order to see if there is a difference. I don't think it will be a noticeably big difference, but now we can... Uh, we can uh, try it out fully spaded uh, when it comes to its mobility, which I'm actually a little bit curious about. Let's actually put one of those mighty fine camouflages on there. There we go. Come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, when, always, whenever that happens, I always get so nervous. Glitch out at 7 million. It's still an insane amount. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah. Okay, looking at acceleration. We're up to 20. We're up to 25. We're up to 30. 35. 40. So I would say that the mobility is about the same as the IKV-91, which is decent for its battle rating. But remember, that thing is 6.7. It shouldn't be six seven. That's a whole different conversation. But uh, yeah, ah, a little bit too hot. A little bit too much to the right. A little bit too low. Got the other fuel tank. He's leaking fuel. We're gonna stop him eventually. Yeah, the new. Uh, the new uh, uh, hitting effect, so it's absolutely awesome. Why is the camo not purple? That's a fair question. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, looking at the uh, rest of the Swedish tech tree, uh, as for tanks, we're not seeing anything new. Sometimes they do sneak in some goodies in there. Um, as for the uh, um, air tech tree here, uh, having this new uh, Dutch aircraft. Um, that was in Finnish service. It has Orlikon 20 mils. Okay. Ammo 120. That's good. And then 7-7 uh, um, seven, seven, uh, Brownings. Yeah. Nothing too special, but it's very nice. I think one thing, people, that is very important in, uh, in uh, War Thunder is national representation meaning that it's it's a very big deal when one nation gets it gets represented like when i started playing this game on a regular basis um i had already i already started playing a little bit in 2014 but then i kind of stopped um because i, I was still in the military and i i didn't really have time to to grind and everything um but um when i started playing again on a regular basis in 2017 um the first premium that i bought SW one, uh, 122. I wish. Uh, 
uh, was the STRV81 in the British tech tree. It was literally the first thing I, I, I bought and went and went for. Amazing. Absolutely amazing tank. Still is to this day. Um, I'm so glad that it's got moved to the Swedish tech tree at all, but that's another conversation. Dutch aircraft. Yeah, exactly. I think it is um, extremely important to have national representation. I think that we should get Polish vehicles. Excuse me. I would love to see some Hungarian stuff, Romanian um, I want to see uh, Greek stuff in there. I want to see, you know, as much of it as possible. Uh, because I think that that is a, such an easy selling point um, for Gaijin to get people from those nations also in on the game. Um, and uh, I just like representation in general. Yeah. Nederlander, Nederlander. Yes. This is my spirit animal. Ah, you're going to get it, man. Toldi? I, am, I have no idea what that is. Dutch and weed. Hey, Shujin, but how you doing, buddy? So hype. Taiwanese F5 coming. Yeah, and uh, I I don't know if you've seen it yet, um, Shujin, but there's a there's a rumor about it. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna get there soon. Oh, dude. I might just I might just get this one. Looking at the roll rate. Ah, very solid. Looking at the cockpit. Oh, look at that sight. Oh, snap. Wait, is that a mandatory thing? I've never seen that in Warthunder before. Okay. That's cool. As for cockpit, everything is in uh, finish. Yeah. Ain't no Dutch, ain't no Swedish. Yeah, this thing handles well. Look at this. Yeah, a little bit too close. Rumor? Yeah, I'm, we're gonna get to it, buddy. Would be really nuts. I love their language. Yeah, I. Uh, I'm not gonna say either. Either way, I just want nations to, uh, to, uh, have the things they're supposed to have. If you understand what I mean. Uh, yeah. Why am I in this thing? I have no idea, man. But. Uh, how many of you who watch me on a regular basis or has ever watched me have seen me in this aircraft hands up i want to see i want to see hands in the chat man i want to see some hands have you seen me play this thing oh by the hungarians then i i think i know what you mean pepe hands there we go yes all right this thing has received quite a significant uh buff reduce speed Oh lord, what have they done? What is happening? Okay, yeah, I'm cl I'm clicking the Y key. I'm clicking the uh, ballistic computer. It has been given a ballistic computer, which means that the lethality of this thing, the lethality of this thing, up, up, up. <laughs> Oh, Murphy, I haven't seen it. Uh, I play it all the time. Uh, there should be a mechanic thing that have nation flag on the stats card. Yeah, we, we're going to test that. Wings will break at 200. Yeah, yeah. If it's not Russian, it break. I tell you, we have sources. Can you provide those? Bliet. Ooh, okay. It wasn't spot on, though. That was. Okay, that's scary. Yeah, I love this plane. I love... I don't know why I love the cockpit also. I like the cleanliness of it. And then uh, you have the uh, the second guy there behind you. Responsible for your 6 o'clock. I like that. Oh, yeah. I love the feeling of this aircraft. It, it, it's also so fucking big, man. It's like... Yeah, I... I come to attack. It is of my role. Whoop, uh. Oh, yeah, here we go, buddies. Coming in for the attack. Ooh! New sounds? All right. 
Alrighty, daddy. Woo! Almost looks like flares. <laughs> yeah, I love this thing. So the A21 has received a ballistic computer. I'm gonna I'm gonna open my sheet document right now and put it up on my other screen here for all the uh, all the stuff that has been added into this here uh, test server. So before we leave Sweden, I'm gonna take a quick um, quick look here. Uh, new vehicles for Sweden. We have the uh, Fokker, which is the one that we were just uh, watching um, for aircraft. And then for ground forces, we, of course, have the mighty, mighty IKV 91-105. Other than that... Uh, yeah, there's a lot of stuff to go through. Um, I will provide this in the uh, chat here so you guys can uh, take a look at it. And then... Uh, um, Whatever the stuff you want me to take a look at, and when I when I uh, when I get to that nation, feel free to let me know, and I uh, will take a look at it. But I think that is it for Sweden. Moving over to France, Viva la France. Um, um, um anything else added for France? Um. Um, 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 no, no, I can't see it. Um, uh, that's it. <laughs> Moving over to Italy. Uh, Italy has actually received quite a few things uh, we're gonna take a look at the mighty pants three up oh. take a look at this vaffanculo mamma mia why is it so short i don't know mamma mia all right we're gonna we're gonna spade it people you know it you know it oh shit we gotta grind the finally grind the uh leopard 105 Yeah, clicking the wrong stuff. There we go. And we're gonna crew it. Trying to see what we can get the reload down to. Oh no, I use some golden eagles. Me, 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 me. Oh, it's so small. Look at that. Hello. Knock, knock. Who's there? Wehrmacht. <laughs> I don't know why. Why I think that's funny. Oh, shit. Yeah. Dude, its velocity is so low, yeah. I suck. I'm uninstalling. Don't worry. It's harder than it looks, people. Don't judge me. Ooh. Guys, help help me out here. Do we have that tank in the German tech tree? I don't want to go over there right now because I don't want to tease just uh, anything new. Do we have that in the in the German tech tree? Oh, you see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that actually. The C version. Yeah, yeah. As a premium. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So now we're loading the 100 millimeter penetrating heat chill. Oh, whoa. What is the velocity versus the holy? Okay, it's much faster. 380. Pog? Fucking Pog? I have no idea how far that is. It's apparently that far. Look at that reload, boys. 
what the hell is the reload? Okay, now we're getting there. Track? Oh, they're just a church. I didn't think about that. Hi. Still pens? Let's challenge ourselves a little bit. I think that's about yay far. Oh my god, don't ruin this now. I don't even see how far off I am. Oh, okay, I'm apparently quite far. Ah! Orbital strike! Ah, shit, I'm too short. <laughs> it's just tank building a bit? All right. Infantry support. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it makes sense. You know, low, low ve velocity for that kind of stuff. I'm not going to spade everything here, but we're just uh, simply going to take a look at... Uh, also, I guess the B version at the uh, at this thing. Yeah, I mean, we've seen this these ones before. Panzer IV is the G version. Uh, yeah, solid stuff. It has the B version of this uh, heat shell also. Getting 80, 80 millimeters of penetration. Um, one thing that I do want to highlight though. Um, oh, wrong one. I love this camel. This looks just so good. And I actually, I actually liked playing these things. I remember. Um, yeah. Oh, I didn't get this one. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I'm clicking all the wrong stuff, aren't I? Yeah. Also, I need to buy it too. Yeah, okay. There it is. Look at that. Doesn't that just look absolutely awesome? Um, other than that... I don't think there's much else happening here. I don't know about any other features either. Um, as for aviation, nothing new. As for naval, nothing new. Happy? Moving on, people. We're going to stay, uh, stay fast. We're going to take a look at this, though. This is interesting. Is it because I enjoy playing around these battle ratings? Maybe. Is it because I'm a notorious douchebag? Maybe. Maybe you should stop thinking about that. I'm kidding. I'm not notorious. All right. And now we've also research another tank i'm sure no good uh we're gonna take a look at the camouflages here people Ooh, we got quite a few we're starting with this one i mean it's a winter camo what, what do you expect oh oh i really like this i really really like this Basic desert. I mean, yeah. Ooh. The Chinese camouflages are growing on me. Very fast. Oh, yeah. I do really like that one. I think out of all of these, I'm, we'll have to go with this one. I don't know why. Um, is it an autoloader? It does not appear to be an autoloader, so I don't really have a good curve for you then. But we're gonna see what we can do with you. Uh, we're gonna do the this thing and then this thing. Just because I really want to see what you what your uh, um what you should be able of getting out of this thing. Da, 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 da. There we go. Oh, we got a uh, uh, ace. It also, yeah. Yeah, test drive. That thing's not where they can. Ooh, the APFSDS is nothing special at all. 
Yikers. They're made by communists. No comments. I'm just not going to be political at all. On Whoa. Whoa, this thing is so fast. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Dude, I'm up to 60 in a wheeled vehicle. 70? Uh, the reload is shit, though. Yeah, you're not getting through there. What was what that? 200 millimeters of penetration? 220 maximum. I'm hitting exactly where I shouldn't be hitting. <laughs> in its defense. Uh, no laser range find either. I mean, 8.0. Uh, I kind of 8.3 I can see it as uh, Because sure he gets an APF is DS But the APF is DS is not very good at all Yeah it, it could also be a dev server thing uh, I actually don't know what the caliber of the gun is Let's go and look into that Ah it's a 76 we done it already, so it's okay to go back there. What is the penetration of the automatic? Oh yeah, they moved the automatic now. It's all the way, all the way down. Whoa, whoa! And this thing is an auto cannon. It is not even a, it's not even a tank destroyer or a tank or anything. This is an anti-air. Uh, not sure about that one, Gaijin. It's a hundred millimeter, is it? Where, where did it say you said? Oh, I, no, I was reading. God damn it. I was reading it wrong. I was reading it wrong. That's very weird. That's the type 69. This one. 105. Oh, this one. Ah, the type 69 game. 86. Could be. Oh, oh, that's depressing. Yeah, not sure about that one. Doesn't excite me that much. Um, all right, moving on. There's nothing here to see. Uh, moving on. Shujin. <laughs> Did you re? I want to see you re. Oh, Lord. We're not taking a look at that for... Re. All right. Oh, yes. I'm researching that. Oh, for Christ's sake. Oh, yes. Yes. New boosters. Always the best upgrade to get. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, you get bull pups. China. China canning to fucking cats now, boys and girls. Aim nine P's. Aim nine P. I wonder what model of the A nine P because I was actually reading up on this. Shout out to uh, um, Justin uh, Justin Plays TV's Discord channel. It's a lot of uh, very knowledgeable people over there. Um, highly recommend it if you're not on there. Uh, oh shit, people! Whoa. Whoa! I I I. It gets like everything. Look at this loadout. God damn it! That's it's a good looking one. It's really good looking, honestly. We're gonna... We're gonna accelerate the training, all right. Are you guys ready? You know what we're doing first? No loadout. 
we're gonna see what this thing can do same as the on the f1 roger that because that's Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. yeah baby um those the p3s are the same model that the uh, rb24 j's are um built upon of the uh of the draken of the draken dude this thing flies way fast oh yeah baby hell yeah oh oh banned for a week oh shit i did okay i didn't know that that sucks oh hey akula how you doing buddy taiwan number one there you go whoa okay let's see how it's uh handles okay i'm liking this oh whoa this flight model is awesome Good gun sound. No uh, ballistic computer, though. Damn. Man, this thing is just... This thing really follows uh, the mouse wherever you're pointing. Look at that. Look at that, people. It doesn't bleed that much speed, either. Uh, do remember that this is the test server, and everything is subject to change. Ooh. What caliber are these guns? Did anyone see that? I didn't think about it. Shoot the guns. Roger that. Ooh. Damn. 20 mil. Am I late? No, I think uh, we have passed Sweden. We have done Italy and we are now into China. We did pass France because France is not getting anything new. Um, oh, yeah, I was going to say this is Mach, Mach 1 territory right here, baby. Oh, yeah. There you go. Whoa, we pulled 16 G's. Um, I think they need to calm down a little bit with that stuff. Holy shit. This thing is so easy to fly. This is so easy to control. See, I can even save myself when I almost fuck up. Lost control even though it's an ace pilot. That's how you know. Oh, this flight model. I, I don't think you will hit the uh, the live uh, the live server like this. That's gonna destroy the game. Everyone with a little bit of skill is gonna get into the F five, and it's gonna be the one aircraft. I don't play a lot of planes though, so I don't know too much about it. All right, keeping it nice and tight. Hey, there we go. We got to hit the ground at some point. They're uh, Pontiac. Yeah, I've heard of that, man, actually. Let's uh, actually bring out a loadout in order to see what's uh, what's up with that. Kind of interested in this, but frankly, this is what we're, we're going to see on it. So we're going to see how it performs with uh, four bolt ups. Oof, it looks... Ah. Oh. It looks beefy, out to be honest with you. As for other radio, uh, or other systems, um, does not appear to have a radar. Acceleration uh, appear to still be good. We gotta flap it out and bring her up. Hey, Kathoda, how you doing? Even E is very pleasant fly but it doesn't oh whoa 
What is the uh, rumor? Um, the rumor has uh, been debunked. Uh, so don't worry about it. <laughs> but but uh, China is now going to get a very, 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 very good uh, uh, ground attack here. Holy shit. Okay, my controls are inverted, so do uh, I do apologize about my aim here. <laughs> Look, listen to this, though. Listen to this. Listen to this. It's very much how... This is actually very much how it sounds inside of vehicles when you fire weapons. But then you also have the shock of, of, of a weapon of the... Uh, uh, like the... Uh, the shock wave of, of uh, small, tiny explosions happening. And you kind of smell the uh, the gun fumes. It's, uh, it's an, I love that smell. Love that smell, man. You mean the real one time one? In the nation of China in War Thunder. That's as political I'm, as I'm going on the Twitch stream. I said that and then a couple of months ago I got banned. Or apparently being political when you made satire of... of of someone, but let's not get into that. It's very difficult when the controls are inverted, let me tell you. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, I don't think we're keeping this flight model. <laughs> yeah. The best one. The best one, indeed. But they seem kind of be low velocity 20s or it's just me being awfully dumb. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Holy shit. Yep. Smell of napalm in the morning. There's no other, uh, there's no other way. But there you go. That's uh, what we have that is new in the Chinese tech tree. So we will have this. I would call the, it's, it's, it's labeled as a light tank. That is a little bit surprising to me. Um, um, but that's what it's labeled at. Um, moving over to Japan. So honorable. Um, not seeing anything new here. Helicopters. Nothing. Army. I did hear something. I did hear something. I did hear about something. Am I blind? Oh no. There we go. Gotta spade it out first, people. Okay. Can it, that work, please? There we go. And boom. Fully spaded. Let's rock and roll. Uh, I do have a good crew here. Yeah. Good. It's like almost as fucking good as it can get. I do. I think it's so cute uh, how cheap it is to uh, to uh, ace your low tier vehicles. And then as you go up, you're kind of like, what the hell? Brown, the traditional warship great camouflage. Oh, God. I, I'm going to say that one for last. Brown camouflage doesn't look too bad, to be honest with you. And, it, and it's a camouflage that works better than a, what a lot of people think. I do like the uh, Japanese winter camouflage. Mighty good. Oh, that's a little sexy. That's a little bit sexy. Yeah. That's sexy. Will. Ooh, traditional. So honorable. I love this. I, I absolutely love Japan. I absolutely love. Uh, all their vehicles and stuff. I don't know why, but I just do. Okay. I do like the color. Not gonna lie. I do like the color. What can I do with it? Uh, it's still gonna be rusty as all shit. I like it. Camouflage scale doesn't do anything. I'm an idiot. Sorry. We're gonna, we're gonna keep that one for the test drive. Because here... That looks very, very German in, in its name. 25 mil on the... Okay. 
semi armor piercing, so it has sap. So it's a sap boy. Nineteenth century gun. Ah, oh, so it is a naval gun then, yeah. Ooh, what's the velocity here? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at that range finder. That's that's quick, people. That is quick. Oh yikes. Yeah, it's a, it's a lot of angle right there. That's not gonna be comfortable for this thing. Look at the, its mobility. Dude, does it have a machine gun facing backward? Does, is that a machine gun? Guys, is that a machine gun? It is a... No! <laughs> that would be me. I know that would be me. Dude, Nick, get on the gun. Yeah, yeah, I'm firing the big gun today. No, dude. Get back there and you're like, oh, fucking hell, man. Fourth day in a row. Hey, guys, is it going all right? Shut the fuck up over there. Okay. I knew that would be me. Um, but there you go. Um, 1898 version. Yeah, I know that would be me. <laughs> you guys are laughing. I wouldn't be laughing. I get motion sickness from riding the subway. Fucking riding the subway is hell for me. Uh, leaving Japan, they, um, only getting, uh, oh, dude, I'm such an idiot. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, So honorable. I have no idea why I'm why I'm specking it. I'm more like look at the model. I have no idea about the data of this ship, but I've started it, so I can't just finish it. It's an obsession thought of mine. If I finish something, I have to uh, I have to finish it. Like today, um, I'm starting to do a little bit more of. Uh, push-ups and stuff at work in order to try to keep a little bit more active and, and uh, uh, crunches and you know shit like that that's what I'm gonna call it and uh, today I just set my mind like I used to do sets of 50 of like real push-ups like all the way down touch the floor with your chest and then like go up um, but I quickly came to the conclusion that I can't do 50 push-ups in a row anymore. I'm like, fucking hell, I've been able to do that forever. So now I've realized that I'm fat and useless and I have to work on it. But enough of that. Let's talk about this instead. What the hell was its name even? Izuzo. Izuzo. Oh, shit. Fire. Woo. Oh, I like the voice. That is so... It sounds so aggressive. I like it. Okay, uh... I really wish the naval would be more... more... Uh, whoa, that accuracy. I really wish naval in this game was more... exciting in some way. Hey, Army Chris. I don't know if I missed someone else. Kingslayer, how you doing, buddy? Um... I really wish that, that naval felt a little bit more like... I don't know how to describe it, honestly. It just feels so... non-engaging to me. I think that is the words I'm looking for. Switching over to secondaries. Whoa, there's a lot of them. Apparently, what am I firing here? 25 mil. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, sh shit. Do I have anything else? Load! Oh, we got a torpedo tube. Yeah, that's right, buddy. You can get crew members like this in real life, you know.
I'm just bored. Yeah, here you go. You would be surprised how often stuff like that happened, Tomato, in, in uh, basic training, to be frank with you. It's it's very uh, unsettling, but it is the truth. So there you go. Japan is getting that big old uh, tank destroyer. Yeah, I was going to say it's going to be a tank destroyer in the game. And then the Uzuzu. Love my Japanese stuff. Moving over to the UK. I, uh, I was going to say, I don't know if there's anything new here. I'm not specking this one, but we're going to quickly uh, jump in here for the sake of uh, inclusion. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's an American voice. Ah, it's Canadian, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't that it? Oi. Gunners are searching for airborne and surface targets. All gunners, hold your fire. The enemy is targeted. Whoa, look at that accuracy. Aircraft. Maybe I should honestly guys, do you think I should I should try out naval a little bit more on stream? Would you guys be interested in that? Like give it to me straight here would you be interested in someone who, who used to play naval games a lot to uh take a look into that the etna whoa i missed something in the talent tree okay secondary i still remember the uh the key bind some that, that actually surprises me oh that's a 40 mil all the way yeah 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 buddy oh what is that Oh, those are, uh, those are, um, um, at the submarine mortars, so aren't they? They gotta be. It's pretty bad right now. Gotcha. It's not getting pretty to watch. I, I yeah, I, I don't think it's kind of in, in, in um, uh, inclusive. Uh, what did I miss then? This thing. No, this is something that was given to me, I think. I don't know. The Etna. What about what 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 is what is that? What have I missed? Oh, oh well, you mean it like that? Yeah, yeah, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Nothing new here. Uh, moving on. Moving on. No, nothing new to the uh, UK. That was fun. Everyone is like, he's such a, such an idiot. I, I have great fears about this thing, man. I have great fears about this thing. Uh, I don't think I don't think they're done with this. I don't think that I'm um, nope. I refuse to believe that this is the only uh, the only bells that they're given this. I refuse to believe it. And frankly, to be to be completely honest with you, even right now with what you saw right there, this thing is, is this thing is terrifying because I, I'm not I'm, I'm not going to say anything. We're going to see when we get into the test drive of this thing. I'm not acing this because it's just uh, it's just an AA. But uh, my, I have I have my concerns, um, and I'm right now, along with you guys, are gonna find out if they're warranted or not because this, <sighs> I wield Jepard, and uh, I like the camo. Oh, this one, yes, that one. Um, I'm quite certain that it's going to get a, um, um, a better AP belt. I say quite certain and I'm, uh, Oh, the radar might not be modded yet. Okay. Uh, look at this thing's mobility. Okay. It's not as bad as that Chinese thing. Okay. It's not it's not too bad.
Nah, we're close. Yeah, fuck your track, dude. Fuck your cannon, dude. Yeah. Uh, to be honest with you, what the bricks really need is mobility. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hate on this thing in any way, shape, or form. I'm very happy. The bricks are one of my favorite tech trees, dude. I have no idea where I am. It looked like I hit him several times there. All right. You might have to turn it on. I did press the uh, keybind for it. I did press the keybind for it. 100% guaranteed, guys. Um, it did not appear to be working. I like these vehicles, not gonna lie. Um, to be honest with you, I've seen videos of a vehicle that looks kind of the same used in early, uh, very political wars down in this region of the world. Uh, I'm not even gonna mention their name because last time I did, um, I got a shit storm because of that. Uh, we're not doing that. Um, but I actually find these kind of vehicles very interesting. Six, seven. I was saying earlier what the what the british tech tree needs has always needed in my opinion is mobility and right now people it does look like the brits are going to be reinforced with exactly the thing that the tech tree needs which to me means that gaijin is really paying attention to what what is needed into the into the game in order to uh make tech, tech trees more relevant because i'm actually quite certain that the british british tech tree is not very much played and uh that gaijin uh, realizes that it does need some help I'm, I'm i really mean that all modifications people uh what do we have we have a smoke grenade i re really love it when you have the ability to fire a smoke grenade it's great for uh, shielding off enemies an he shell there's no one ever going to use and then oh shit. oh shit. six seven are you are you okay are you okay there buddy i don't know about that one i don't know about that one they said it's not oh, okay 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 calming my tits down six seven Represent from all over again, dude. I gotta. I I did forgot to check if it had a, um, if it comes with a proximity shell. I don't think so. Man, the elephant doesn't have his composite armor. Oh, look at this thing! <laughs> what is that? What are those? <laughs> That's so funny, though. Look at that. <laughs> what the fuck am I driving? It's not that mobile, so everyone can get their hopes down. I think. Ooh. I didn't push the uh the brake the brake there. Let's take a look at that again. It slows down a lot. That might just be the driving the module of the vehicle, but okay. It slows down quite fast. Six seven reload on a vehicle like this. I mean you can't fucking hide. But you I I'm I'm sure you're gonna have a uh, good mobility on the uh on roads. I mean, it's recently or um, reasonably um, stable for. Uh... For a vehicle. All right. It's very fucking chunky. It is a battle bus, isn't it? And then you have the Roy cut. It's now in this tech tree. Very fair. Very fair. Don't have a problem with that. All right, we're gonna move on. What is the uh oh? Um, I'm actually not gonna look at this. Look how uh, how raw its model is. <laughs> um, because we already have one of these exactly like it in the game. Yeah. Um, and it being seven zero is the same as it is in the French tank tree. So I'm gonna move on from that one. Um. Because I'm very, very, very excited about some other stuff that I know are coming. Oh, sorry. 
this this i like 20 millimeter cannon milan atgms battle rating 73 and you know what you know what i actually think this is fair because you know what vehicle i'm thinking of the bmp1 Although I haven't looked at their uh, their statistics, um, so I'll I'll uh, take that statement back, people. I'll take it back. I mean, oh. yeah. I mean, okay. It can be. It can be seven seven, can it? I think so. I think so. Yeah, I like the email ml90 it's a it's a it's a very fun vehicle it's very uh fun that you can uh you can completely deck it out with uh uh <laughs> with uh, all the uh, bushes and stuff but you you literally can't even see it you it looks like you're driving uh a bush it's that much bushes on it bushes for everyone all right um we're gonna take a look i'm guessing it has those two camouflage yeah that's a good look for it Let's drive it. Uh, look at it. Looking at the belt, nothing too bad, to be frank. Yeah. Yes, oh, what the hell is that, torturers? I mean, you you can do damage to this. Uh, mouth button five. Oh, what the hell kind of keyboard is that? I never set that up. Mobility. So and so. Actually, not that good. And then magic happens right as soon as you hit the road. I think so. Accelerating. 40. Yeah, it's not it's not that fast of a vehicle, to be honest with you. The BMP is uh, a worse worse enemy than this. I mean you're not even hitting 50, are you? Stop the vehicle be firing. Is it balanced? I mean it's not very maneuverable. turret though it's very slow turning i've got a bonus to say i don't think that this thing uh is too badly balanced gun elevation sorry sorry good point uh, we're looking at 38 minus 8 and uh, plus 38 uh, 282 horsepower yeah that's your problem right there uh, we're also gonna uh, take a look at the belts for this I forgot about that incendiary tracer and then the normal one is self-destroying and then the M13 also that so it does not get any proximity or anything like that um, which I think I think that's a good thing um, yeah Moving on. Eight three. I, I, it's funny to me that the uh, South Africans have a winter camo, and to my knowledge, I'm gonna be that ignorant. I don't think they get any snow whatsoever, as far as I'm aware, in South Africa. Feel free to correct me. I love to be uh, challenged in uh, stuff that I think I know, because it's always always good to find out that you actually don't know about something that's what i'm gonna say okay what can we get this down to then uh yeah heat okay that's not too bad okay that's not too bad to be honest with you oh 
To be completely honest with you. Yeah. Oh, don't do that. And boom, and boom. All right. Easy peasy. Let's uh, take her out. That's 400. We do get some snow. Oh, shit. Well, thank you for... For, um... Tell me that. I do like the storage compartment. It's always good to have your crew's um, equipment always stored on the outside. It's always a good idea. Okay, it's a Centurion. No high people. Whoa. It's a little bit low there on the uh, heat shell. 6.7 though. That reload is mighty fine. It's a Centurion. It feels almost identical to the Shotkal and the uh, uh, SW uh, 104. It's kind of like it feels like it has slightly of an upgrade, upgraded engine. Um, but that's about it. The shell itself seems to be uh, doing just fine. Nothing too special. I think 8.3 will uh, suit it mighty fine looking at what uh, the competition is. 750 yeah 56 tons is it that heavy oh spoilers sorry <laughs> what the hell is this yeah small pp small pp backed up with three big pp i don't know i love that camo Moving on, 8-7. Where, where does it get, it get this 90 millimeter gun from? Wait, what? And it's tandem. Okay, the Brits. Um... Tandem, of course, means that it has dual charges so that it can defeat some um, ERA and stuff like that. Uh, thought I missed something there. Did I? Click in the wrong tab. Excuse me. So many things to click. And there we go. Should have to select it also, right? Yeah. What is the night? Wait, am I am I that stupid? Did I just not see the gun, or was it that I had researched them? Some... I am so confused right now. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, that's the, they called this a cannon. That's why. Uh, yeah, that's what it is. Look at this small PP. Uh, it appears that the missiles are not working. Uh, this thing feels faster. It accelerates faster, at least. So this thing is so ugly. I... Let's see if it works with the other missile. No, I had that one selected also. It doesn't work then. Um, then we're going to move on. We're going to have... Uh, we're going to take a look at the 105... Mighty, mighty, mighty. Stop clicking the wrong thing. Roy Cat. Ay, 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 ay. 
already the reload is down to 6.7 does that mean it's an auto loader we're gonna find out feels like i'm sitting here spading uh vehicles all the time that's all i'm doing all righty Heat. Bloody British. Bloody British. Oh shit, no. And they're hesh. Oh, well, I'm seeing thermals. Was that DM23? I mean, for a wheelie boy at 9 3, this is very good. I don't think we're looking at, at a. Oh, we are looking at an auto loader. So it was a very specific number. That's why. Love that turret. Yeah, it does. It does look good, doesn't it? I mean, it is very flat there at the at the back. No commander's thermal, but gunner thermal is gonna help out for sure. We have the right APFSTS. We do. I mean, 6.7 stock then, so you don't have to worry about, like, getting reloaded upgrades and stuff like that. That's good. This thing is quite mobile. Looking at the, uh, looking at the speed on there. Holding 43 solid over terrain. It's not too bad. The, uh, turret is extremely fast to maneuver. It feels, uh, like it has good, uh, controllability. And it does listen to all my uh, my inputs very nicely, very neatly. Yeah. Uh, no smoke grenades, but a smoke screen. Where's the rangefinder? Yeah. Back of the turret, instant kill. I'm, uh, I'm afraid of that. Yep. Um, very nice. I do like that. Do like the feeling of that vehicle. Now going over to the Olifant. I mean, I think it looks good. So you got has that going for it. And as for nine seven, nine seven, you have uh, kind of a good uh, lineup for the British. So you might get some reinforcements there, but also depending on the sh shell. Okay. Um, it's a 105 then. Yeah. God, it made me worry there for a bit. Whoa. I was like, no, not more of this. Why is everyone getting good ammunition for their MBTs? But one nation. That was my concern for a second there, but it didn't happen. So we're good. But we're looking at thermals, laser rangefinder, smoke grenades, the whole nine yards. Oh yeah, we are. Oh shit. There we go, spending some money. Where we're at? Six seven. Alright, 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 alright. Okay, screw everything. I'm not. Don't care. There we go. Acceleration. That's good. Okay, top speed wise is kind of underwhelming. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. What's the muscle velocity though? Whoa, it's kind of low. What's the caliber of this gun? Yeah, it's not that it's not that long. And I'm messing up my shots. And I am messing up my shots. Uh it seems like this patch is gonna make Britain 
ever so more relevant which to me is very 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 welcomed hey daft how you doing buddy um I'm very skeptical about the uh, being on par with the Leo 24 aim range. Um, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna kill that that um, statement um, with the fact that first and foremost it is a 105 millimeter gun, um, and then its mobility is also too bad for that. Um, I don't know about its range and everything. Um, but armor wise i can't say anything because i don't know anything about it literally anything but just looking at the top of it here uh the philosophy in, in modern armored warfare is that mobility is firepower if you don't have mobility you don't have armor you can literally mean you can be the most reinforced bunker ever uh, have the thickest armor on your tank ever but if you can't move uh, the enemy uh is going to be uh, able to outmaneuver you anyhow and get the shot on you so uh yeah as for uh oh no no okay it might not it might not be this might not be the finished product because we can get the uh i probably we can probably do the uh apds um let's not look into that that's why i usually don't show that on the uh on the uh, uh test servers because it is simply not um relevant because they're gonna change it 62 times before we get our hands on it um that's everything for the british i would think i don't think i missed anything Armed with the 120 and full of 40. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I, uh, I, I, uh, I don't have an educated guess even. Um, I'm, I'm gonna put it like that. BT7 and then the um, very funny looking uh, T28. Um, these were featured on the, uh, the test server or the uh, uh, stream there from Gaijin themselves. Uh, it does look at like a chunky boy. Let's just go straight away here. These vehicles uh, don't uh, change that much, much if you ace them or research everything. So. Normally. That's a lot of machine guns, my man. Statistic? Whoa. Oh, yeah, it's 2.0. This thing moves. This thing is completely stock at this time. Mm, did I miss that? Or did you just ask me because I have it? This one? I think it's very good. Uh, I do enjoy it. Yeah. I do enjoy it. Um, is it worth the money? I actually don't know um what to say about that um uh, sorry for just jumping between here uh looking at the coastal fleet we got the new okay no uh, it's not the ship that i thought it was um this thing looks a little bit modern as for blue fleet we got nothing aviation we do have something i believe and it's right there the first swoop wing or sweep wing i have no idea how to say it i'm not from the uk might winged aircraft 30 millimeter camo or ammo i mean don't let my mind speak to you and expect anything what are those what are those and what are those okay we got something here people did I see gun pods? Did I see gun pods? Did I see gun pods? No. Oh god. I just wanna. Ooh, what? 
birthday. Okay. I like that. I really like that. Aren't these AGMs guided missiles? Holy shit. We're getting into that, huh? We are getting into that. Just this penetration is amazing. Okay, so it's just no. Wait, did I just? Ah, uh, oh, what the hell is that? Wait, what is that? S24? What is that? Why am I clicking the wrong stuff all the time? No comment. What do I need to do? Oh. Wait. The symbol is that. Oh, okay. Oof, I got worried there for a second. But the S24 gets six of it? That's what we're going with. Oh, yeah. These are bad boys. Hey, Oler. How you doing? Um, hey, Harman Gori. Worth on sale? Yeah, I would say so. I would definitely say so. On sale? Yes. Don't don't get me wrong. It is a very 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 fine um, aircraft in general, guys. No music, none of my voice. I'm gonna increase the the uh, audio level here. Oh, it doesn't have a cockpit. God damn it! Starting up the engine. Are you ready? Let's go. Ah. Oh. No, I'm doing good, Oler. Thank you for being here. I was like, is that it? Okay. How do you control the wings? That's what we need to find out. Aircraft. Didn't they say something about it being connected to the, uh, not the, uh, the, um, um, the controls used for hovering and all of that. That's what I remember. Whoa, whoop. Uh, are you okay? And why menu? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, hey. Uh There there you go. No? Drag shoot? Oh. Oh, you mean on the controls? Oh, sorry. Ah, well, oh. oh, you got to do that. I have no idea what to put this on. I'm doing that. Oh, they don't stay there. Oh, because you got to do that thing. Yeah, yeah, wait, wait. Isn't it something? Is it like, isn't it this or something? I don't remember. 
Yep. Dude, this thing is fast. Oh, is the computer on? Oh, this is that fast? First swept wing aircraft. Guys, who's with me? Who's with me in the chat right now? F-14 win. F-14 win. Give me an F-14. Maybe not yet, but... I mean, we're, we're, we're obviously getting there, right? Looking at the speed. Push and mock. That's accurate. That's really accurate. Those are lasers, man. Holy shit. Okay, gonna take the wings back out. Here we go. Turns much sharper. A noticeable difference for sure. premium iranian <laughs> i would laugh so hard for that like see like see all the uh all the u.s mains be like Ree! oh my god it's an american aircraft <laughs> growing man all right you got it hey uh burke did you see you there Yeah, this thing moves. It feels very Russian in its control, and I'm not entirely sure how effective this uh, this whole um, uh, swept wing thing is going to be. Um, but I like it. Oh god, that that wine was very strong. Excuse me. Uh, nothing else apparently is being added for the uh, for the Russians. It's gonna happen. Yeah, <laughs> Yamato. Actually, I actually I really believe you. I really believe you have this um, thing, which is just like the BT-7, but with a slightly more powerful engine. So you ha you're up to 35 horsepower per ton with this thing. That's a lot. That's a lot. Not gonna lie. Uh, moving over to Germany, we're gonna do the coastal fleet just to see it. Is there anything new? Is this thing new? Why do I have this thing? Is is this is this new people? That looks remarkably modern. Is this new? Dude, I have the page open here. Kaiser. Is that the Kaiser? No? Oh, it's an event vehicle. That's why I have it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Ooh, okay. Yeah, the Kaiser. I, 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 uh, I saw this one. We're, we're looking at old school battleships, baby. 305 mil. We're going to take it out. Just for the sake of great titties. That was a joke, by the way. Nichtspritzen. Nice to spritz. Then like then slug and bad. I have no idea what I'm saying. How do I do this? Well, I fired something. Oh, that's that's a torpedo. Where is the torpedo? Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's like a proximity, like last stand. It's like a last stand thing. Fire the torpedoes! I'm not gonna lie. That's actually awesome. That that feels powerful. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not even gonna try to sugarcoat that. That feels powerful. I do like that. This like, if, dude. Can you imagine how fucking how stupid this is gonna be, for for your friends? 
Yeah, I know, I know, I know, no, no, no. There we go. Whoa, we're gonna look at the effect one time. Don't worry about that. Whoa, 305 mils. That's what you get. Turn on secondaries, you got it. The last stand torpedoes. I love it. All right. Are you ready, people? We're going to watch it in uh, third, third person camera right now. Here we go. Woo! That's a lot of damage. Switching over to secondaries. This thing has a lot of it. Yeah, that's nasty, honestly. There you go. This it's a ship. <laughs> that's what I'm going to call it. Um, still, still not into uh, really into the, uh, naval stuff okay looking through the tick tree here they got nothing all right nothing new in the helicopter tree <laughs> yeah okay so we we're not getting the okay wait wait a second Okay, no, yeah, we're not getting the uh, new Leo part. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough, I guess. I'm, I'm actually very concerned about this thing, and I, I, I am very, very, very much against uh, uh, Gaijin's decision to add this vehicle to Germany. Not that they're adding the vehicle, but if you think about it, the turret is from France. And people say, well, Austria and Germany, close relations. Mm, not as close as you might think. However, there is a nation that if you don't want to give it to France for some reason, I don't know why, why you wouldn't want to do that. If you don't want to give it to France, there is another nation which has very close uh, political ties to uh, Austria. Okay, that's camouflage is gorgeous. Oh, shit. Oh. That's not a bad one. This one, given. And uh, which country may I be talking about? I'm talking about Italy, people. Do you want to go that route? I don't know. It's not up for me to say. I just try to provide some kind of entertainment. Um, but I don't think it belongs in the German tech tree. And I'm going to be very open about that. I know that there's a lot of people who... Uh, Who dislike that but you gotta be honest and, and be like does germany need this no and it's of a very good generation of course that's what we wanted to see you later all right see you see you around buddy Oh, shit. What is that reload? Personally, couldn't care. There you go. I don't think it's going to be game breaking. I just I just don't understand what it is with uh, everyone wanting to give the, the Germans such a get out of jail free cart all the time and then if you say that and you're too vocal about it you're gonna get the weird boost on you and they're gonna be saying well actually this thing seems to be exactly my kind of vehicle but it's also gonna be everyone else's kind of vehicle because this thing seems to me to be very 
very OP. Not gonna lie. With this ammo, yes, yeah, this is this is over the top. I don't like this. I don't like this in the way that um, 9.3 seems way too low for it. And the Germans does not need this. <laughs> the Germans does, don't need this. Hey, uh, yeah, yeah, Lady Lynx. I didn't know you were here still. Oh, that's what I meant to suffer. There you go. It's four second. Yeah, it felt faster. Yeah. HSTV. Okay. Yeah, I can understand what uh, the reference there. Uh, but I'm not missing anything. Um, I think we showcased everything because we are moving over to the United States of America. Uh, going over to the fleet part first. Got nothing in the coastal fleet. Look at it, the blue fleet. Can't see anything. New nope. aviation. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, I gotta select it as a can. Yeah, my bad. Yeah. Yeah. Where the hell did I put this thing? There you go. Yeah. Not entirely sure about this one, Gaijin. Not entirely sure. Not entirely sure. Ah, oh, shit, man. I don't know about this, people. This this makes me incredibly worried. Not gonna lie. I do love this new HUD, though. People, look at this. Look at what Gaijin has done. Look at what they've done. That is dead on gorgeous. There's no other way to say it. But I'm, 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 I'm gonna have to be very, very honest. Um, I'm not sure about this. Yeah, the HUD looks amazing. Look at that. I don't remember the stock binds for readying up a missile. Holy shit. Oh, okay. You can do that. All right, all right. See you later. All right, people. How do I? Wait, what? Why is it on that? Okay. Whoa. Alrighty then. That was indeed guided. Yeah. I don't know about this. Oh, 
Oh, you're so okay. You're supposed to. Uh, okay, now I get which button you know, I'm, I'm supposed to click. Okay, all right, all right. And this thing is also very fast. I can't forget about that. You got it already. Got a good cannon, and now you're getting Mavericks on top of that. Yeah, here's some. Here has some aim nine J's also. Oh, it's locked. Okay. See you later. I'm so skilled. Got two more targets. Yeah, I don't like this one, but I mean, I understand me correctly. I do kind of like that you can engage SPAs with something that is like equally cancerous. Locked. <sighs> I just don't. I don't see the logic behind this now. Because yet again, man, they're bringing in a, they're bringing in a, an, a system. I'm not saying that this thing is going to be overpowered. Don't get me wrong about something like that. I'm not saying that it doesn't necessarily have to be, because the enemy, the enemy's anti-air power is usually so great. But if if you play your cards correctly, you can of course be very, uh, very uh, hard to knock out with it. Hey, Dave Bizet, man. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, you smoke through the counter. Not even every... All vehicles that can be countering this thing. This thing is 9.3 at this time. I mean, they're going to move it up again. It's already been 9.3, 9.7. It's 9.7 now, right? Yeah. Um, it's going to be, uh, you know, moved up to 10.0. What? 10.3? For what, man? I don't get it. I don't understand. Why not wait until more nation can have... Can have Maverick-capable aircraft? Why? Look at how this thing handles, man. It literally has... It, it feels like... I, I, I completely... Admit that I am a mediocre air player. Sure. No problem. But what's the deal here? I don't get it. Well, I'm out of fresh out of targets, aren't I? Can you maybe review the... Oh, I have. I've already been there. I've been started Sweden now or all the way up to uh, uh, the US. So I can do a small review here for it for you. Um, right now, it only has its... Um, its um, um, its casted um, armor for it. It does not have uh, its other armor. Um, other than that, it does get uh, generation 2 thermals its uh, mobility seems to be uh, decent it gets dm63 so it has a solid shell although it is just a 105 um so uh, i don't know about its armor at this time i don't know about its uh um like how its end stat so to speak is gonna be um i have ace the crew um so i um it's it's best possible reload is going to be um 6.7 was yeah so you have a complete package here oh my bad uh thank you so very much for the follow truly really appreciate that um you do have kind of a complete package here though you do have uh thermals you do have um good firepower uh, mobility seems to be decent and we will see what the armor turns out to be uh but that's pretty much it 
I keep it 105. I'm very happy to go back to that one. I, I don't mind doing some some recaps here. Um, not at at 9.7. That that is still a nice buff to the uh, to the British tech tree. Yeah, there's no other no other way to see it. Um, take a look at the IKB uh, 91105, a vehicle that I've been working on for months to get into the game. Um, um, it does get a very decent APFS DS. Um, its mobility is decent and uh, it's just cute vehicle and it has a four second reload whoa ammo oh. So as you can see, this thing has 12 shells in its ready rack and uh, it can just uh, do it all. Yeah, this thing is not going to be a three for that long. Um, I can tell you this thing is also lacking its thermals that it should be having. I have reported that already to uh, um, to Gaijin, so they are aware of that. Um, smokes, artillery, it's going to be able to scout. This is not an 8.3 vehicle, people. I uh, I expect it to be 9.0. Um, if it's below that, I'm going to be disappointed. I think it, it deserves to be 9.0. Jumping over to America. Good old USA. Uh, I wanted to see if that rumor was true. It's not, so thank fuck for that. Um, a vehicle, yet again, that I'm very much looking forward to. I am a light tank kind of guy, and um, these kind of vehicles are exactly my thing. I want to see if it does have its correct belt right now, though, that it should be having. There you go. Um, as far as I understood it, there's a lot of M's today. Um, 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 sorry about that. I'm uh, getting a little bit tired also. We're going to wrap it up here in a bit. Thermals. Tomes. Toes. And you're supposed to uh, also, as far as I understood it, to get uh, APFSDS was, was the th with this thing. We are, of course, going to look at the uh, camouflages before we take it out. Stop clicking the wrong thing. Oh, yeah. This thing looks much, much more chunkier. I do like that. Oof. That's good looking. Oh, that looks so classic, though. That looks so classic. Oh, never like that one. This one is really good. Winter. Uh, it's a good winter camo. Here we go. That's the one yeah oh yeah that's so good looking we're taking it out these are nothing in particular with these right no this is APDS though up tier Bradley oh it's weaker at the moment it will get it will get the top attack version hell yeah look at this thermal though Can I fire them? Oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot to keep mine again. <laughs> okay, that animation sucked. Um, that new animation right there, that did not look good. Um, in terms of mobility, I, this thing feels mighty fine. I gotta, I gotta be honest and say. not penetrating all right took a while whoa did you guys see that how quickly it stopped did you see that oh 
Okay, that new animation looks like shit. Overall, a very, very uh, fine vehicle, I gotta be honest to say. Very nice looking uh, thermals. I think they're Gen 2s. Animation without the thermal? Good question, honestly. Because that sucked. <laughs> Let's just be frank here. Yeah, without without uh, thermal, it looks much better for sure. That's how it looks actually with the uh, tow system. That's exactly how they look. Uh, no reload animation as of yet. I don't think I can fire ATGMs because this thing has this uh, blocking system. Yeah. So then you disable the. Uh, the blocking system right. if you hit it On target. yeah it looks hell of a lot better without the thermal i mean i do understand that it pixels up a little bit i've seen that before in real life in thermals um but not to that extent uh most likely a dev server thing don't be worried about it um other than that, and uh, I think we've showcased everything. And uh, just to do a quick little rundown here, uh, some of the stuff that I'm most excited about is actually this thing. I'm not going to bring up anything here because this thing, I don't, I really don't like it. I don't like the new squadron vehicle. Um, as for the uh, uh, Russians, there's not really anything. I do like this mobility buff to the British. I do think it is, uh, I do think it is needed. Um, I'm just not sure that these vehicles bring that much to the table. They're just massive. And I, I choose the one and only thing. I don't know their names. I'm sorry, people. Uh, I don't know about this. <laughs> like 280 horsepower and 18 tons. Wheeled vehicle. You can go 30 kilometers an hour. Yeah, I don't know. Um, but I am excited about the, the British getting more feature more because hopefully this brings up their mobility a little bit. So you ex you have you have options on on, on certain maps. Um, other stuff that I'm uh, that I am uh, um, interested about is uh, this thing. This thing for those of you who didn't see it, let me show you. It's APFSDS is an utter joke. 8.0, 220 millimeter. Look at this thing's mobility. Face palm with me, people. Yeah. Hey, Sneathan, man, how you doing? I can't grind British past 7-0. Repair costs are huge. Are they though? I didn't know that. Yeah, that's right. Ooh, is that an auto cannon? Or is that just ah? Oh, it's a oh, okay, okay, okay. That reload, though. Yeah, look at this mobility. This is what we need at 8.0, people. Eight point zero people. Eight zero. I mean, the thing is like this. I would love for them to because there are wheeled vehicles that can perform kind of, kind of in this uh, uh, in this matter. I I don't mind vehicles like that being added, but it can't be eight point zero and like a uh, and like uh, this this much of a speedy boy. That that that's not good. That's not fair. And I don't think that we want we want that in the game. Laser rangefinder, 
No. Okay. No thermals. And the APFTC is, is, is not that dangerous. But holy shit. Centurion vibes. It's 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 even it's even faster than that. Um Italy are getting some World War II stuff. We have a Panther 4G, we have a Stug 3, and we have a Panzer 3. Um, that they are getting. Um, I don't think that we're getting anything in the aircraft department. France is not getting anything as of yet. Um, I I would love for them, uh, to be honest with you, I would love for Gaijin to step up and move uh, uh, this atrocity to uh, to the French tech tree. I think they deserve it. Um, I don't think the Germans uh, should get it. I don't think they they need it. Um, if there's nothing else, I would still I would move it to the Italian tech tree if I was guiding, because uh, the uh, the Austrians and the uh, the it Italians are uh, close politically and everything. Um, so if you want to go that route, then yeah. And then uh, my own little country is getting the IKV ninety one one hundred five, uh, commonly known as IKV one hundred five only, but it is what it is um that's it um other ch other changes is uh, or um new additions is of course the uh the fucker and then the a32 is getting reworked here um it is getting a ballistic computer yeah that's about it um quickly gonna look at the where's my baby there it is No, that's the same. Yep. Um, that is going to be it. I would love vegan. Yeah, we're not, we're not getting vegan though. Uh, people, um, I have been working for 12 hours today. And uh, I'm getting very tired. So right now, I am going to uh, call it for tonight. And uh, I will go eat, drink some wine, and be with my girlfriend. And I will see you tomorrow after I've had a very nice breakfast because tomorrow and on th uh, Tuesday it is uh, my days off so I will be streaming then of course so if you haven't pushed the uh, follow button please do so and I want to say thank you so very much for hanging out but I'm gone so see you tomorrow later people